Yep. You guessed it. It's time for your rotten theology lesson. I want to talk a moment about the hatred of God. The Bible says God is an angry God, and you ought to fall down on your knees and praise that He is. Wait a minute. Come again, motherfucker. I should fall down on my knees and thank God for being an angry son of a bitch. What's wrong with you? You smug member of the heavenly in crowd. How dare you say I should fall down on my knees and thank God that he hates my family members who I love. You ought to fall down on your knees and praise that he is. I thank God for his love, but I do not like his wrath. You said it yourself. It's, a, it's, it's an offensive subject. You Fuck you. Oh, the wonders of the love worth finding, as Adrian Rogers' ministry used to be called. And Carlos finished her off. Yes. Love worth finding? Well, it's only worth finding because if you don't find it, you're going to bust hell wide open. The sting of, the sting of religion is fear. And the strength of this fear is that we're all going to die. Nobody gets saved because they love God. They get saved because they don't want, uh, they're terrified of God. It's fear. The driving force of all Every religion, do these the sting of religion is fear. Remorseful or not, Tabitha and Carla. The sting of sin may be. The sting of death may be sin, but the sting of religion to make this scene look like is terror of hell, of hell. And the strength of the terror of hell is the death rate on Earth, as Don Piper said in the video, is 100 percent. No, none of us are gonna be getting out of this life. Let's talk about John Calvin. He's praised as being a mighty theologian to the glory of God. I call him a murderer who stole God's vengeance. He said God, Jesus, is the eternal son of God. One of his contemporaries said Jesus is the son of the eternal God. Well, John Calvin was in government. He had this heretic burned at the stake, and he had green wood used so the fire would, so the torment would last as long as possible. Taking vengeance from God what? If he let him live, God is not God enough. But the judge see to it that the true doctrine we went over the false doctrine. Well, looking at Christianity today, maybe we we need a government to oppose impose a death sentence upon heretics who do not preach the pure faith as it was delivered once in the, under the saints because God said he established government to take revenge for him since he's not yet come to reign and when he comes to reign he will take take over that role it's really hard man I need God I need Jesus but I need him I need him I need him but part of me has a hatred for God because he hates men. I praise God for what crumb cakes of love we can get from him, but I hate him for his wrath. I hate his. I hate the side of him that's wrath. I hate that other side of the coin. I'm I not gonna be thank, uh, thankful to God for wrath. So nuh -uh. Fuck that and fuck you too. You can thank God for his wrath for me. 
because I'm not going to do it. I do not like the fact that people like me are going to burn forever just because of God's temper tantrum. 